Sister Wives' latest update, Cody Brown pleads with his estranged wife Janelle to reconcile, despite her clear happiness alone. With tensions rising over property disputes and Cody's past behaviors, fans are left wondering what will unfold in the upcoming episodes. Will Janelle give him another chance? Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day, after watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Sister Wives Spoiler, Cody Brown Begs Janelle to Reconcile In a Sister Wives Spoiler, Cody Brown begs his estranged second wife, Janelle Brown, to reconcile. Janelle has already made it clear that she is perfectly happy without him and on her own. So, what has prompted him to come crawling back? Keep reading for more details and to find out when to expect his groveling to air. Cody Brown begs Janelle to reconcile. When Christine Brown Woolley was the first to stand up and say she was leaving Cody Brown in 2021, it was a shock to the system. She was tired of the way he had treated her and her children. He had also withdrawn intimacy from their marriage and lastly, he wanted allegiance to Robin Brown. It was clear that was and long had been his favorite wife. He would never say the words out loud at the time but Christine, Janelle Brown, and their children saw it. Cody was shattered at the thought of a divorce, but would have been fine if his first wife, Mary Brown upped and left. However, she stuck around, largely due to Robin and her faith. Then, he and Janelle became more estranged, fighting, he was gaslighting her, and not seeing one another. Finally, she decided she and Cody were done and she was moving on, not needing a church or a lease. Yet, Cody never understood why they could not make it work. Mary got the hint and got her release, but according to an upcoming episode, Cody still has hope for Janelle. A Reddit thread shared descriptions of the upcoming Sister Wives episodes. A lot is going on starting with the Sunday, October 20th episode. Janelle wants to settle things regarding Coyote Pass with Cody as she mentioned she may lawyer up. Then, fast forward two weeks to November 3rd, and it says, Cody suggests reconciling with Janelle. Janelle has openly said that she considers herself single at this point. Mary may have felt the need to get a release from the church, but Janelle and Christine did not. Holding on for what? Robin Brown was desperately holding on to Mary Brown because she could not let go of the idea of having sister wives. In the latest episode, Robin was bawling in the closet over everything she would never have. It was Christmas and she was reminiscing on holidays past. There was so much she missed and how she hated not having the large family around her because all she wanted was polygamy. Now, she was alone with Cody Brown and their children which was not her dream. Since Mary has cut ties, is Janelle Brown the last resort to unite the family? Today's next update, fans believe Cody and Robin's kids are being used to rewrite history. Sister Wives spoilers suggest that fans believe Cody Brown and Robin Brown are using their kids to rewrite history. Viewers have been watching for every little screw-up this season because they know the shows have been editing out all of Garrison Brown's appearances. It also seems that a lot of damage control has been required as well. How are the children being used? Sister Wives spoilers, fans accuse Cody and Robin of rewriting history. Sister Wives spoilers reveal that at the beginning of the show, a disclaimer was posted nothing that this filming started in 2022 and that Garrison Brown has passed away in March 2024. Of course, this means some scenes had to be res hot as well as some being deleted completely. Unfortunately, it is very obvious that a lot of scenes have been filmed out of sequence. Between the edits and the reshoots, Garrison has been completely wiped out of this season's episodes. Of course, the family, especially Janelle Brown, probably couldn't have gotten through if things were left as if nothing ever happened. Fans believe that Cody and Robin's fight was just one of the scenes changed to make them look good. Sister Wives spoilers, do kids age in reverse? If you watched last week's episode with the family game night, it becomes very clear that some of these scenes were res hot. In the game night scenes, Robin and Cody's children look considerably older than in some of the other scenes. Sol's hair is considerably longer and so is Ari's in that particular scene. However, Thanksgiving, which was shown after, both of them as well as the older children looked considerably younger, at least by two years. If TLC is going to edit the show, then could at least make the editing make a little bit of sense. 
We all know that Garrison had passed away while this was being filmed, why not just explain the edits? Sister Wives spoilers, fans noticed another issue. Gabe Brown's hair was another big issue that one fan did their own write-up on. Fans know that Gabe had his long hair while all of this was going on. However, Gabe cut his hair a while back and in some of these scenes he goes from long to short and back again. None of the edits are done with any particular care, that is for sure. Whatever the case, fans certainly believe that a lot of the reshots were simply done to make Cody and Robin look better because it was obvious how Cody had treated his kids all along. As of now, Cody doesn't speak to the majority of his kids. Cody's estrangement with Maddie Brown Brush certainly comes up a lot. Of course, Cody makes it all her fault. Today's next update, David Woolley reflects on one year of marriage with sister wife star Christine Brown, I'm so glad she found me. David Woolley is enjoying marriage with Christine Brown, one year after tying the knot. In an October 14th Instagram post, Woolley shared a selfie of the couple with the caption, I was in Sedona a few weeks ago, it's really really pretty there, just like at Christine underscore Brown Sue is. I'm so glad she found me, and stalked me, Woolley wrote. This last year has been a hell of a ride. She's the most thoughtful, loving, caring person. I'm enjoying this ride and want to just keep riding. The couple marked their first wedding anniversary on October 7th. It's been incredible to have you as my partner. I feel so blessed to be married to you and I look forward to the rest of our lives together." Brown, 52, wrote the day of their anniversary with an Instagram carousel of pictures of them with their loved ones. In late September, the Sister Wives star posted about her husband ahead of the marriage milestone. Almost a year later, and I still feel like I won the lottery marrying David, she wrote on Instagram. Every day, I'm reminded that love truly can be better than I ever imagined. Never miss a story, sign up for People's free daily newsletter to stay up to date on the best of what People has to offer, from celebrity news to compelling human interest stories. Woolley and Brown went public with their relationship in February 2023, not long after she had split from Cody Brown, who was also married to Mary, Robin and Janelle at the time, in November 2021. The couple got engaged in April 2023 in Utah and tied the knot later that year at Red Cliffs Lodge in Moab, Utah. We just liked the idea of having as much family and friends there as possible. It's going to be absolutely the best beautiful day ever. Brown said ahead of their big day. Brown told people about the first conversation she had with her now husband. I messaged him first and then he responded, Brown said in October 2023. And at one point he said he liked camping and I was like, that's not going to work for me then. And I threw my phone across my bed and I'm like, nah, dot. She then had a moment of clarity, deciding that camping wouldn't be a deal breaker. I'm like, okay, I can be an adult. What if he's the love of my life, is camping going to stop that, she recalled. So I messaged him back and he's like, a tent? God no, I have a motor home. I'm like, oh, I can do that. He's like, I do glamping. I'm like, oh, we're fine then. Because camping is not my cup of tea. Thanks for watching this videos, please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.